In the past, co-op crews and contractors would inspect equipment and lines here on the ground. But from this vantage point, you can't see everything. And that's why this year the co-op decided to scan the lines from the air. The sound of a hovering helicopter could be heard over Sussex County in May as a co-op contractor inspected power lines. Attached to this helicopter was special imaging equipment that uses a laser to produce detailed images like these. The images will let engineers here at the co-op know where trees are too close to our power lines or where the power lines are too close together or too close to the road. The aerial scanning only took a couple of days but will provide huge benefits to the cooperative. So once we receive the images in the report, we'll put together a plan of action to fix any issues that are found. Our goal is to have these issues fixed immediately. Crews will continue to inspect utility poles for rot and other problems from the ground. Co-op officials say using a combination of aerial scanning and traditional inspections is cost effective and more efficient. We maintain more than 7,000 miles of power lines and it's a big job. This type of scanning helps pinpoint problem areas and helps us fix them to prevent future outages. It helps improve our reliability. It's good for our members and the cooperative. Improving reliability one flyover at a time. Efforts to make sure your lights stay on. I'm Jeremy Tucker for Delmarva Life.